Wagwan people, we are back. Become a legend. One club man, episode two. And Brian made a brilliant start to his Sheffield United career. Got a goal on the open day of the Premier League season. And today we're moving on again. So the brother's been picked for the team. Big up yourself, Brian Chambers. We're playing Newcastle away. Going to be a tough old game. Have we at least got a little bit of buzzard about us? Nope. We've played insane in the middle of the road. But hopefully we can supply McBurney and we can supply Billy Sharp up front. Let's get it, brothers. So straight into it. This again, Newcastle are probably going to be struggling with us. So this is a massive, massive game early doors. You know what I mean? The first win of the season was huge against Burnley, but this is even bigger. So today we've got Newcastle. We'll also start the FA Cup adventure against Cardiff as well. And let's see if this brother can beast and feast straight away. Be nice to be captain eventually and win a trophy with Sheffield United. That's the aim. And hopefully get picked for England and become captain of England as well. Let's see if this brother can go all the way in this one. So Newcastle versus Sheffield. St. James's Park, brothers. John Joe Shelby's got a fresh buff shine on his head. That brother blinding everyone in the sunlight. Well, here we go. Geordie's in full effect. The Yorkshire men have made the travel up there. Can Sheffield United keep on winning? Like I said, we're aiming for survival this season. A nice cup run quarterfinals would be lovely, but survival is the main thing. And then we're going to try and press on from there. I'm already making runs forward. I mean, look at the sizes, brother. The legs like a friggin' ostrich. We can make up ground, don't worry about that. With the new talisman of Sheffield United. Ball's whipped in, can we head it clear? We can't. Another Sheffield player steps up to the mark. Yes, brother. So nice little move out. We're quite slow in possession against Burnley. I can see this being the same thing. Oh, look at me, I'm right here. Right, let's switch it. Oh, come on, ref. Really, ref? I'm going to slide this, brother. So again, at the moment, we're only 72 rated, so the... Uh, the turning circle of this brother is not great. Let's be honest. But it's okay. To be fair, the afro isn't helping as well. There's twigs and leaves and birds nesting in there and everything, man. So it's slowing me down a little bit. But we're good. See? Now, there we go. Nice little switch at the moment. It's all Sheffield United. A little spin move. Billy Sharp! Woo! As much as that brother is aging, we know Billy Sharp can finish some things. He's out to prove that he can do it in the Premier League because his brother's done it season in, season out in the Championship. It's about time Billy proved it in the Premier League, brother. Come on, guys, sort yourselves out back there. So we're going to have a few numpties over the seasons. I'm hoping, like I said, if we can stay up this season and we consolidate ourselves a little bit and the club ranking goes up a little bit as well, Sheffield will make the same kind of move transfer-wise. I put transfers on fairly high, so the frequency of them is. So hopefully, we start investing in the club a little bit more. We've got the fan base, we've got the stadium, why not? At the moment, we're kind of out of the game a little bit. Everything's bypassing and it's going bypassing in the field. It's a straight launch up field. It's going to be one of them games today, brothers. It's not the best two Premier League teams at it. I'll have again. Right, so we're going to try and dictate everything. Nicely done. Nice little move. Go out wide again, McBurney. You're on your own there, brother. Got the overlapping run for the fullback. You know what? We're going to make up numbers as well. Kind of cross come in. Come on, brother. Damn. Oh, my Lord. Dallying about. Just whip it in with your left foot, brother. Newcastle can clear their lines though, but again, straight to a Sheffield United player. We are playing five at the back. At least three centre-halves and uh, two full-backs. So I can't see many teams breaking us down, or at least taking a while to break us down. And again, I'm in the box with them. Why can nobody cross in this game? It's gone wide now. We're just going to try and hold our own. There's nobody there. Where's the full-back for him? The brother's making all the runs himself, though. Probably because he is the full-back. <laughs> Whip it in. Beautiful. He's in there again. Oh. Nearly found Chambers. I have to sprint back into midfield though now. Look at, I said, look at the jet lag on the, on the afro. Seriously weighing me down. Yes, lay it off here. That's nice. Not enough room for the shot though. I'm going to play it back into McBurney. Stay on side, brother. Damn. McBurney trying to sneak back in from an offside position. The linesman has got Hawkeye vision on him. Ain't getting away with that. I think one thing we do need to learn as well, after we've done captaincy, I think the long-range drive is a must. Because by the looks of this, we're going to get a few little um, pings from outside the box. Especially with two up front. We can press up and make that extra man. We'll be that attacking midfielder. You know what I mean? If we can average 10 goals a season, 10, 15 goals a season, it's a big thing. Eventually, we want to be like Frank Lampard getting 20 a season, ideally. But I know the first couple of seasons, it's going to be hard work, really. 
with 72 rated player all the way across the mix and nobody wanted it Newcastle again putting the pressure on still no nil at the moment and again for us boys we'd take a draw away from home against Newcastle it's not ideal but again against one of our rivals for relegation let's be fair we'll take that where you're going there we go where can we go anywhere else can go anywhere we have to go down the line again but I'll join up with you though go 1-2s again if you need nicely done send yourself down get there get there get there don't make me look like a bad pass whip it in oh my lord I'm going to try and knock this down though the afro's in there hit it get myself in there dally on the ball again it doesn't fall nicely to us though and they can break here's the scowls we managed to hold them up a little bit the energy's low let let these boys deal with it and they do we'll go back to the centre midfield position here we go again McBurnie back to feet brother Inside, inside. There you go. Oh, nutmeg dim. <laughs> Half time, no, nil, nil. We've not been able to influence the match too much. It's been all Sheffield possession wise. We've had the one shot. But again, at the moment, you can tell these teams both nervous beginning of the season. No one wants to lose. I think both teams would be happy for a draw. The subscribers are happy with a draw. So let's try and get this winner. Different type of player for me this season. Obviously, we've done striker last season. We've got another striker in Regular Boy Junior. So I'm used to taking the game by the scruff of the neck and scoring the goals that we need. So in midfield, I'm trying to rely on these two brothers up front to try and do a job. At the moment, we are top goal scoring the team. Ah, again, that little turn. I don't have that spin move yet. Oh, that Michael Jackson spin on him. What we can do is break up play, though. I wonder how long it'll take me to get our first yellow card. I will be slide tackle on this. I love a slide tackle. Don't worry about that. Win your header. Nicely done. Laid it off. Beautiful. Again, my touch isn't brilliant. I can send him away though. Come on, Billy. Battle Billy. Battle Billy. Slap on the back of the head or something. Pascal's good defending though. Ten minutes into this half. We've got about half a bar of energy. Inside, look at the space. Ah, oh, I was there. Edge of the area ping. Nicely whipped in. But Bernie's there off the bar. McBurney with the Big Mac header. Big Mac and fries, brother. But he can't get the sauce. Unlucky for Sheffield United. That was a good chance, though. There's only going to be two or three in these types of games. We've gone attacking as well. I think the gaffer can sense it. Mr. Wilder can sense the uh, smell the fear in Newcastle. Trying the through ball, though. Nearly worked out. Bit of a hospital ball there, ref. Oh, wait, ref? Come on, man. Need a hit replacement after that. Not the ball past him. The Newcastle player just barged into me. We don't have strength yet. I think we're going to keep the strength training up quite high as well. I'm going to be an absolute beast in this midfield once his brother gets some strength as well. Look at the size of him. At the moment, we are getting shrugged off the ball quite easily. We are a youngster. Go that side of him. Nicely done. Back again, Billy. Beautiful. Going to go for the big curl. Nah. Too far out. But again, the young man making up the numbers. Southgate in attendance. Now, let's be fair. Southgate wouldn't be here watching this game. <laughs> Eventually, he'll turn up to some of my games. He has to. I'm doing too much already. For him not to. Tell it would be cool on Pez though if there was like an under 21s teams as well and he got called up to under 21s first and stuff like that. That would be dope. Can we get there first? We can. McBurney. Find Billy Sharp. Or send me. There's two of us in a box. Get a ball in. Ah, deflected wide. We can't pick up the rebound though. Again, it's fallen to me. Oh! <laughs> I swung a leg. Hit nothing but fresh air. And we've got 20 minutes to go. And again, we're going to have to sit and do the Makaleli position in a minute. We, we have got low energy. We sit there and break stuff down ourselves. Don't let him spin move you. Don't let him spin move you. Don't let Jolene do that. There you go. Get away, Jolene. All right, knock it into him. It's you two brothers on your own. Send Billy Sharp. Go on, Billy. Prove the doubt was wrong. In the Premier League now, Bill. Finish it. Billy Sharp. Sharp as a nail, brother. Get in there, son. Billy Sharp makes it 1-0. Sheffield United. El Capitano. B sharp in the house, have a mouthful of afro, sorry brother, <laughs> just jump straight into his face, but what an important goal, and to be fair we deserve it, we've been solid, we've kept our shape, we've played as a team, and the two boys up front link up and Billy Sharp is rolling back the years, strike it brother, beautiful, what a finish from Billy, get in there Billy Sharp, we'll take that all day long, so McGoldrick is on for Bernie, McBurney, I don't know what McGoldrick's going to do, but McBurney needs a rest by the looks of it. What's Gaffer got us doing? Gaffer's in terms of defensive again, so we're going to sit in this Makaleli role. 
I'm gonna watch this brother up front. Look at his brother's hair, looking like Count Dracula in his piece. Who is there, number nine? Is it Andy Carroll? Andy Carroll's gone grey as anything, man. I'll get him then. No one wanted to tackle the brother. Look at that. We're doing all things. So, like I said, we're going to learn captaincy. We're then going to maybe put the attacking midfielder position and long range drive on the next one. So, it will take a while to learn these. But I think we'll go attacking midfield, defensive midfield, and centre midfield. That's the three positions we'll have on this one. I don't think we'll bother with the wings and stuff. I may even sling in support striker, so you never know. They could always sling us up top if they're short on numbers. Um, but we are generally going to be a centre midfielder. And, like I said, I want the captaincy on because I want it. basically that bad boy. I want to be captain as soon as I can. And again, we're breaking stuff down again. Talking man of the match performance from this youngster again. You know Billy Sharp will get it though for the goal, but this brother's been on fire. Here, to the side, to the side, I'm here. There you go. Where's my fullback? Let's go back. We don't need to rush it. Four minutes to go. I'm still on the wing. And again, deep if you need. Nice little ball up. Intercepted by Newcastle though. We're not going to push forward too much on this one. Just in case Andy Carroll does something. Nope. <laughs> Andy Carroll looking like a broke vampire. I mean, <laughs> what have they done to you, Andy? That brother greater than my grandma. My goodness. Get this brother some just for men. Anyway, it looks like we've been taken off. We have done. We've gone back to stadium view. Who came on for us? Who dare come on for the reggae boy? Hello, the reggae boy. Sorry, the B Chambers. You need a lot of that. I'm used to doing reggae boy. So, Brian Chambers has taken a seat. I've got my mustache comb to straighten that brother out. And we're chill. To on stadium view for this bad boy. We won't fast forward. It's only a couple of minutes left. Can we hold on? Ten more seconds. Blow the whistle, ref. There's the, the great vampire. The fruit. Woo! The referee could have played that Newcastle a fuming. But Billy Sharp with the winner. Newcastle nil. Sheffield United won. Brilliant. Another step towards that magic 40 point mark. That's all we care about. But that's a huge result. Absolutely huge. So we're going to press on with the press on. Should at least get a 7 for that. Don't be stingy, Pez. 6.5, you son of a... So McBurney and Shaw got a 7.5 each. Come on, brothers. For me, you brothers have lost 3-0. All right, check your coupons, guys. If you have got a winner, let me know. All right, so at the moment, we're joint top with City, Arsenal, and Norwich. It won't last, but hey, we'll enjoy it while it does. Two games, one goal, no assists yet. Stats beasting and feasting already. So let's press on. So Cardiff are waiters in the FA Cup. This will be a tough game, even though Cardiff are a championship side. Um, again, we've just come from the championship, so ain't going to be too much. But Sharp's there in full effect. Uh, obviously, no transfers are coming in for us. And we're not leaving. This is a one-club man. I'm sticking around. I really am, unless Real Madrid offered me 25 million, then I'm gone. No, I'm, <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm going to stay. I'm going to stay. So, again, I've got like a week and a half off. So here we go. Cardiff City are next. Let's get it. I'm starting at least. Yes, I'm starting in centre midfield. Beautiful. We'll take that all day long, brothers. So we've got them. Oh, no, wait a minute. What about Cardiff City? It's Charlton. What on earth was I thinking about? All right, never mind. Anyway, then. It makes no difference to me. Still a championship side. And we're buzzing this time. We've got Lundstrom buzzing next to us as well. So I think we're going to get a goal in this one. I think I'm going to predict it. Why have I gone back to game line? I'm sorry, my guys. I'm sorry. Here we go. Kickoff time. <laughs> but yeah, I'm feeling another three well another win and hopefully another goal in this bad boy so Charlton in the FA Cup I do believe there's this round then it's the quarterfinals so I want at least quarterfinals that'd be nice here the cup run you never know if we can maybe sneak through the back door a couple of easy draws we we'll go all the way to the final that'd be amazing um, but yeah a cup run would be nice so here we are in Charlton what's the name of their stadium now Berg Stadium so another team that's probably sold the rights to their stadium we've got Ahmed in there Pierce Cullen KL Oh, Sheila. Well, let's get it. The Charlton fans are behind the cage. <laughs> Obviously, restless fans. But one thing we need to do in this game is make sure they know we're a Premier League team now. Stamp power authority. Obviously, Charlton, I think, just came up from League One as well. So we need to show them, like, fair enough, last season, there wasn't much separating the teams, as in position-wise in the leagues. But now we're a Premier League team. We're a force. We don't act like no championship team no more. And straight away, we're in. Brothers in behind. Slow it down a little bit. I'm just going to make up the numbers just on the edge of the box. Just in case something flies out. Number seven's watching me like a hawk. Ball's played in. It's punched away. Knock it down for me. First time. Even I don't know what that was. <laughs> Let's just say. The brother got underneath it. That's one of them. That's one of them shots he did back in school with the school shoes on. Have it. Yeah, that was it. 
That was a John Smith moment. My bad, my bad. So we've uh, we've established the brother can't hit things first time yet. So, <laughs> but it's, it'll come Brian, don't we? Send him in, send him in. Take it on. You're on your own. Shoot. Come on, two or three. Come on, two or three. What a finish, brother. And we won the look already. And who the hell is it? McGoldrick. My goodness, brother. And McGoldrick's going in there. We're all going to pose for the cameras. Why not? My throw won't fit in it, though, so it's not going to look good. But it looks fresh anyway. It looks fresh to death. But McGoldrick with an absolute step over. Mousset, you've copied my moustache. I've just realised that. Me and Mousset. Oh, my goodness. That's shocking. Little ball in. But look at this. Round the defender. Shoots across the keeper. What a finish, McGoldrick. I'll take that all day long. So yeah, me and Mousset looking like a couple of hillbillies in this piece. Uh, I can't believe he stole a moustache idea off me. To be fair, I'm probably not old enough to grow a full moustache anyway. Mousset probably is, but man looks fresher. Well, out wide. Inside now. That's nice. Don't You don't need to heel flick it. I'm right here. That's nice. You don't look at the space. Look at the drive. Lay it off again. Oh, good save for the keeper. We'll follow try. I love a long distance. Sir. And again, this young man in the mix of everything for Sheffield. Going well so far for the young career for the brother. Inside again. Now Charlton going to try for the back. Oh, Shililala to Kyle. With Forster Kasky. You brothers have got some long names in Charlton. Seriously. It's Taylor, though. Bit of a short one this time. But again, he's in again. Look at that. On the feet of players. This brother can defend, he can pass. You can sort of shoot if your goals were like rugby goals, but the brother can do everything. We can build up from the back again, nice and steady. Into feet, that's nice. Press the wrong button, my bad. Went to go press X and my thumb slipped onto square, so. But it's another shot on target. <laughs> there will be schoolboy errors now and again. You brothers get everybody else on YouTube editing every little detail out. You're seeing the full skin and teeth of everything, brothers. So now and again, I'm going to mess up. And again, nicely done. Oh, I'm trying to flick it over it. I know Shilalala put his Shilalala's on the line and blocked it. Here's Hamed. Nicely done. Come on, what an assist or something at least. That's beautiful. And we can drive into space again. You're on side, finish it. Beautiful finish. And that surely classes as our first assist. McGoldrick, oh, I got a funny feeling he's going to be an offside thing coming up in a minute. No, we got it. McGoldrick's doing the Ronaldinho celebrations. He doesn't care. He usually when he spins around like that, it means he's been disallowed. Yeah, it's me. Don't worry about it. It's me. My brother, my brother is squared up to me there. It's like, who's hugging me from behind? Well, again, driving into position. I thought he was offside, but the left back's playing him on. Oh, my goodness, McGoldrick is on fire. Maybe it's his level, though, championship football. But either way, that brother's got two goals. Charlton nil, Sheffield United 2. And again, we've influenced this game as well. It's looking good. I mean, if he carries on, by the end of the season, we'll be the highest rated player in Sheffield. Because I, <laughs> I think the highest rated player is probably like 77, 78. I don't know when he checked it, to be fair. We're already 72. So let's be fair. We play every game. We're probably going to be pushing maybe the 77, 78s by the end of the season. And the good thing about doing this become a legend, even with this team, we get to play every game. Sometimes if you move clubs, you don't. Uh, so it's best to move clubs to, well... When you are ready to, I mean, check out the opposition. Check out, ah, back in again. That's nicely done. Check out the players the team's already got. See where you're going to be in terms of rankings. You should have buried that, brother. So, yeah, if you're going, if you're going to go straight away from a 71, 72 rated player, say you start at, I don't know, Wigan or something, then you go, yeah, I want to be transferred to Manchester United. The likelihood is you're going to be on the bench quite a few games until you can prove your worth. Just like you do in any other game. So sometimes it's good to start at a lower team. We're quite lucky with Sheffield. to play three in midfield. Only two of them that are not starting are remotely near us stat-wise. So we're always going to get a good game. Um, but yeah, if I'd have gone anywhere else, you never know. Say if I'd have gone Germany or Spain or something. Their lowest teams might be a little bit higher rated than Sheffield. I don't know. But yeah, it's good. So the regular boy juniors obviously start in the championship. Again, that way you get loads of games as well. Ah, cleared away. And I like starting in the championship with that brother because then he can do a bit more. He gets a few more goals as well. And then we move on to the Premier League from there. But this guy's going to be a one-club man, so I thought, you know what, we'll start him in the Premier League. Sheffield looked a good option. I had a look. I knew they'd be the well the lowest-rated team in it anyway, so I knew we'd get them. So I thought, you know what, why not indeed? But it's deflected over. Woo! And the keeper makes it look calm. I'm sweating here. And the keeper's like, yeah, don't worry about it. Don't worry about it, Brian. I've got it. Right, long ball up. 
And there we have it, half time, a goal kick with two awesome finishes. Charlton basically look out of their depth, brothers. But I'm happy with this, we'll take it all day long. So here we go, nice ball out wide. What can we do? 45 minutes to go, can we get another assist or ideally a goal? I want to come through and finish the game as well. We did run out of energy in the last one. We managed to last 80 odd minutes. Look at that header. Absolute power. And I got fouled for it. You can't mess with the afro, brother. Undercover, brother. You cannot mess with it. Look at the leap. My afro alone is taller than you. Get off my nipple. Lay on. <laughs> brother, just nipple twisting me in midair. What kind of bull dookie is this? Get out of my damn way. Nice ball over. Knock it on, knock it on. Ah. Another man goes down, no touch. Nicely done. We're gonna have to flick it on, finish it. Give me another assist, beautiful. And there we have it, I'm gonna run with you, brother. We're gonna be assist galore. Moose, the mustache brothers, linking up. Looking like the Chuckle brothers. Moose, that's needs lining up a little bit. My mind's a little bit fresher. I got mine straight from Chapel Town. Mine's fresh to death. But straight in, interception. Back to the reggae boy, flick on. You do your thing, Moose, Cup draw one. Oh, one. Let's get round to the next round, brothers. Charlton nil. Sheffield United three. No comeback for Charlton here now. They've still got the whole of the second half still to play, brothers. So it's going to be a long old afternoon for Charlton. Nicely played inside. K out. Out wide to Solly. Played in to Taylor. There's Cullen. And Sheffield United intercept again. Nicely done to feet. Oh, we spam move him. Well, that's nice. Oh, lucky. So it's a nice little break going on. But yeah, as soon as we can as well, we're going to get that number eight. I want to be like Stephen G. Stephen G? <laughs> Stevie G. But yeah, like number eight or... I mean, look at the midfielders back in the day. Patrick Vieira had four. We were a bit of like a Patrick Vieira type of player. Roy Keane was 16, wasn't he? Gerard was eight. So yeah, that type of mold of player we want to be. Box to box. And then we got them putting through. Ah, I thought you were making the major run. Oh, and McGoldrick's offside looking for the hat trick. To be honest, I'd have probably asked him to pass it again and sweat it across to me. But that was thing. Anyway, Mousset's going off for Billy Sharp. That's it, man. Give yourself a round of applause, brother. Make sure you get that moustache lined up at Chapel Town, brother. Don't come back looking like me again. 30 minutes to go. We've still got a good beast of energy ourselves. The gaffer will probably keep us on because we've got a couple of assists. And generally, they do. If you score and stuff like that, you kind of get given free reign to finish the game even with no energy blocked out there though I'm going to have to come back and defend get in there get in there go on buddy damn Charlton had whipping one in move one Woo. and Taylor with the volley I think that's Charlton's first attempt in the game though to be honest they've been poor we will take that all day long we're putting the high press on now we're going to go along we're going to join up with the strikers again that's nice can you win it with Bernie damn Back to the centre circle I go. <laughs> 24 to play. Really want a goal in this game. Well, here come Charlton. They're looking for a consolation, if anything. Ball in. This is their chance. And they've got one back. The game's not won yet. And Solly celebrates at the back. And it's Ahmed. Charlton 1. Sheffield United 3. I personally don't see they can come back into it. I don't think they will. A little bit good we've conceded. First goal we've conceded this season, to be honest, as well. Inside, that's that. Go wide, that's it. I'm making that little space in there. Ah, you've dropped off five. Back again if you need. That's it, don't be afraid, don't be alarmed. There we go, you're two on two, brothers. Work it out. Ah, making that darting run. Can you get there? You can. Should have whipped it in, he didn't. Oh, my goodness. My brother got taken out. To be fair, I think he won the ball. The brother's got no eyebrows, but I think he won the ball. My goodness, he's got a f Look how angry this kid is. If you look at this, he plays the ball before he gets O'Connell. I'm letting I don't know, actually. His trailing leg gets him a little bit, I'll be honest. All right, do we have free kick duty? We don't. You know what we're going to do, though. We're going to ask for that pass. Ah! Win that header back down. Beautiful. Get a hat trick. He does! <laughs> and we get a hat trick of assist. And McGold just gets his hat trick. Charlton are dead and buried. They look like they're getting up on the floor. And McGoldrick just pops up to him straight in the knackers. Sit back down again, brother. They're out of the cup. And I do believe we'll have a hat trick of assists. That's it. 
Man, hey, watch the soul glow, brother. All right, don't mess up with the afro. But head it back down with the height. Magoldic with the touch, and that's definitely another assist. Beautiful things. So Charlton on one, Sheffield United four. Let's just manage this game now. See it out. The tight marking McGoldrick after he's got a hat trick. That ship has sailed, brothers. Nicely done. And he's in again. Good defending though. Charlton basically trying to make sure they don't get embarrassed now. Intercepted again. I'm going to slowly jog into the box. Not going to waste too much energy. And now I'm going to make a burst. Because if the ball comes in nicely, the big man is up. Oh! <laughs> Afro power. Looking like the black power range in this piece. Oh my goodness. I think I just come onto it too strong. Look at the leap. Oh, I should have buried that, to be fair. The centre half just saw the Afro and went, you know what? Do your thing, brother. I'm not even going to try and jump and jump with you, brother. That was just unreal. What a power header. <laughs> when that heading goes up, we're going to be a beast. We're going to absolutely be a beast. I'm loving this midfield position so far, I must admit. All right, into feet again. Into feet, brother. Where are you going with that? Come on, well, well, well battled. It's going to be a Charlton throw, though, I do believe. Yes, it is. All right, Charlton just want this game to end now. They've had enough. The big man has been torrid for him, but it's another performance in the books. AD Boothroyd, the M21's coach, been looking at it. But I think this brother will bypass straight into the England squad. Could be a season or two till we get there. There's a lot of midfielders in England that are higher rated than us, but none that play like this brother. Got a dominating midfielder for years. That's it. Nicely done. Inside. Ah, I thought you were going to go sweet pass. We're in. Ah, cleared away. Gonna have to call it back in. Sorry, Gaffer. I know we're falling up. I won't track back. I'm just going to jog it in, brother. I've got no energy. There's two other brothers back there that can defend, but everyone's backing off again because we've gone blooming defensive. Easy enough for the keeper in the end. We're back in position. Five minutes of injury time. Damn. I didn't realise it was that bad. We're just, again, we're just game management now. Easy enough. Bit of hospital ball there. I'll have to feed though if you want one. We're just, we're just taking the mick out of Charlton here. Oh, this brother gun gets... Oh, my goodness. What kind of pass was that, brother? Oh, big man. Didn't win it. It's in, and we get hold of it, but that's it. So, a great episode again. A 1-0 win against Burnley in the first episode. A 1-0 win against Newcastle. 4-1 in the cup. McGoldrick gets the match ball, but let's be fair, brothers. You need to be high-fiving me. I got an assist of hat-tricks. Now, if I got another 6.5, I swear now I'm a drop-kick Konami in the face. Let's have a little look. What do we get? Seven? What? I got three damn assists, brother. Let's have a look. If three assists. Oh man, I mean look at my graph as well. I'm everywhere, man. Apart from being the damn goalkeeper on both teams, I was everywhere. Give me a seven. That's some bullshit. Anyway. So check your coupons, brothers. We'll have a look who we've got in the next round of the cup. We do have Wolverhampton, so again it's gonna be a bit harder draw, but it gives us a chance to get through. Okay, we're still a 72 overall, but now we've got three appearances, one goal, three assists. So we're looking good there, brothers. That's not bad at all. Early doors. So the next episode, we're back in the Premier League. We'll have a little look at the fixtures. It's going to tell us straight away, to be honest. We've got Bournemouth. So again, another one of those lower league teams we need to face. Let's try and pick up these points while we can until the big guns arrive. So next episode will be Sheffield United and then we go to Arsenal. And then it all begins. Oh my Lord Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we need to pick up some points quick before these fixtures come in. So the next episode will be Bournemouth and it will be Arsenal away. So in the meantime, brothers, smash the rass out that like button. Hit the subscribe button if you're new. Wah, wah, and welcome to my channel. Hit the notification bell. You know the rules. You know miss a video that way. Peace and love and I'll see you on the flip side. Peace. Jingle.